very happy Easter Sunday to everybody that is present in this congregation this morning. May the Lord bless you all for coming. Amen. It's our turn to sing together now to give praise to the only one that has opened the way to heaven for each and every one of us. We're going to blend our voices by singing from our SSNS in number 152, the traditional Easter song, Up from the Grave, He Arose, is Risen Indeed. You are welcome to the house of the Lord on this blessed Easter uh, morning. We pray that the Lord God of Easter, who appeared to Mary, will appear to each and every one of us present here today. Amen. And for our internet audience, wherever you are, we pray that that same Lord that can appear anywhere without any disturbance as a result of any door or window will appear to you too. Amen. Just in case you are visiting or just um, around the corner, we want to let you know that um, you can as well come in to join us for this wonderful, special Easter Sunday service. We're just starting. We are located on number 95 Fenham Road here in Peckham, SE 15, 1AE. You have only missed the prelude with the orchestration Christ the Lord is raising today and the choir that have given us um, a lovely song, Jesus Open the Way. Now it's our turn to sing together. If you are unable to make it, you are welcome to remain wherever you are and join us in the singing and in the service. And as we have already prayed, the Lord who knows your location will certainly bless you wherever you are. Amen. We're going to take two verses of uh, 152. Let's take verses 1 and 3. Verses 1 and 3. And for our song leading this morning, we have Anu Shodipe to lead us. going to sing in Christ alone and we're going to sing this with confidence we're going to sing verses 2 3 and 4 in Christ alone
we have a cause to rejoice because Christ has risen from the dead. So the next song we're going to sing is from SSNS 155. Rejoice, the Lord is King. Your God and King adore. Mortals, give thanks and sing and triumph evermore. Lift up the heart, lift up the voice. Rejoice aloud, ye saints, rejoice. We'll sing um, SSNS 155 verses 1 and 2. stand to sing all the four verses and uh, all the five verses and uh, the last verse the orchestra will join us to sing let's us stand let's all stand to sing all the five verses and can it be let us sing heartily because this is the this is the story of our lives all of us um, as sinners God came and redeemed us so let's sing and give praise to the one that redeemed us
heavenly Father. Thank you. Amen. You loved us, Lord. Thank you, Lord. And you gave you all for us, Lord. On the Mount of Calvary. You suffered. You agonized. For our sake. Oh, what wonderful love is that. Amen. Yes, Lord. Lord, we thank you for Good Friday. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Yes, your name. We thank you for today. Yes, your name, Lord. Despondence is over. Confusion is over. You are rose from the dead. Lord, reveal yourself today. Show us your salvation today. Sanctify, baptize. Lord, give us a great revival. Lord, thank you. In the mighty name of Jesus, we pray.
Glory be to God. Amen. Amen. There is hope for everyone here today. Yes. That's true. The hope of the resurrection. Mm -hmm. I just pray that God will help us to cue ourselves into it. Amen. This Amen. wonderful thing God has done for us. Yes. Mm -hmm. Let's turn back to the text that was read for us. First Peter chapter 1. Just read verse 3. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, yeah. which according to his abundant mercy mm. hath begotten us again unto a lively hope right. by the resurrection of Jesus Christ Amen. from the dead. Right. Amen. Amen. He didn't Amen. stop, they went on to an inheritance yes. incorruptible yes. and undefiled. Oh, yes. And that fadeth not away, Amen. reserved in heaven for you, Amen. who are kept by the power of God Amen. through faith unto salvation, ready to be revealed in the last time. Amen. Just um, today's um, celebration of hope. Yes, it is. Blessing. We, we know a lot about the resurrection of Jesus Christ. If I call any maybe small child here, can start from the beginning how it went. Have um, a clip of two kids sent to me on the WhatsApp. See how these children were reciting, talking from the death to the resurrection and um, the joy that they showed in their faces. I think that is what um, we should have today. Yeah, amen. amen. <coughs> True. I'm not going to start reading from where they buried him and then, oh, he arose and no. We just want to see certain aspects of this resurrection mm -hmm. and see um, the significance of that to us yeah, as um, children of God. Amen. Even to those who do not know him, who have not um, experienced salvation, uh -huh. um, there is still hope for them. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, yes. Yeah. This is um, um, God's mission accomplished. Yeah, yes. praise God. There's nothing to add to it. Nothing. God finished it. Oh, yes. That's true. And when Jesus said, it is finished, right. it finished there. Yeah. yeah. And when he rose triumphantly, mm -hmm. Oh, we have nothing else to add. Nothing else. But to just submit to God yeah. to help us to line our lives in the way it would please him. Um, hope. We hear the word hope. When you look at around us, you see um, hopelessness right. and despair right. everywhere. Right. But uh, one thing is sure, there is hope in Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 Mm. Hope in Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. The one man of God said, um, what oxygen is for lungs, such is hope for the meaning of human life. Mm. Can you think of a life without hope? Mm. It's hopeless. Mm. But God has not called us into such a life. No. Peter, who wrote this um, place we have just read, we, um, if we look back to his um, experience during the episode of Calvary, he could now write looking at the events that have passed right. and then now he, he just wrote this um, triumphant note to us yeah. to remind us mm -hmm. that we should live in praise to God yeah. Amen. God is worthy of our praise oh, yes. Amen. Praise, God. praise 
God. Apart from the fact that he created us and put us in this world, has a, um, I don't know how to call that plan. He has a perfect plan for our lives. Yeah. yeah. And here we are celebrating mm -hmm. what Jesus did for us. Mm -hmm. No wonder he said, blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen which according to his abundant mercy uh -huh. hath begotten us again mm -hmm. unto a lively hope mm -hmm. by the resurrection of Jesus Christ from the dead. Praise Amen. God. There is hope that mistakes and sins can be forgiven. There is hope yeah. that we can have joy Amen. Peace, assurance, yes. and security Amen. in the midst of the dis, um, despair of this oh, age. Yeah. There is hope that Christ is coming soon. Yes. There is hope that one day there will be a new heaven Amen. and a new earth. Amen. And that the kingdom of God will reign triumphant. Amen. That hope. The Bible calls the blessed hope, yeah. a lively hope. Yeah. What more can we talk about than to raise our Ebenezer? Right. It's a hither to God you have helped us. Yeah. Yeah. We just pray that God will help us not to despair when we are faced with the problems of life, mm -hmm. situations. Mm -hmm. Let's um, always draw our minds back to the work of Calvary. Yeah. Jesus paid it all. He did. He did. And this resurrection that gives us hope mm -hmm. is that no matter what happens, let's look at um, the, the disciples or the apostles and the other disciples, how stranded they seem to have been. Mm -hmm. The master is mm -hmm. gone. Mm -hmm. And in that, the despair and bewilderment Jesus appeared. Yeah, amen. May Jesus appear to us today. Amen. amen and amen. In our various circumstances. Oh, yes. Whatever way. Amen. I don't know how you feel. Sometimes it seems all is gone. Mm -hmm. But Jesus is there for us. Yeah. Amen. He has risen. And look at um when he he rose from the grave, um, we we read in Matthew that um, when he rose, that the graves were open. <laughs> Wonderful. The graves Wonderful. were open. <laughs> All right. I don't know what graves mm -hmm. people are in today. Mm -hmm. God bless him. Amen. Mm -hmm. Graves. Mm -hmm. Think, great. Graves of hopelessness, of despair. Graves of disappointment. Graves of prayerlessness. Lack of consecration. Graves of laziness. Right. Lazy to read the word of God. Mm -hmm. Graves of different sizes. Mm -hmm. True. It's true. Grave is a place of confinement. And Jesus wants to resurrect. Amen. Amen. In our individual circumstances, 
Praise God. That will be our life. Yeah. Amen. May He do that for us today. Amen. Amen. When He went to the grave of uh, Lazarus, He before He even wept. Um, the sisters were talking. Uh, if you were here, mm -hmm. Jesus felt with them anyway. He said, I am the resurrection and the life. Amen. Hallelujah. He that believes in me, though he were dead, yet shall he live. Amen. And whosoever believeth, and leave it me shall never die. Praise God. And he asked a question. Believest thou this? Mm -hmm. That is uh, that should be our concern yeah. now. Yeah. Do we really believe? Mm -hmm. Because from the story given us in the Bible about this resurrection, even the disciples. Well, if you call that forgetfulness, I don't know. <laughs> or unbelief, I don't know. But may God help us Amen. not to forget. He has given us this Holy Spirit. And we send the promise, said when the Spirit will come, it will lead us unto all understanding. Yes. will remind us. Yeah. May God remind us. Amen. All the things he has taught us. Mm -hmm. He has shown us the way. Yes. He wants yeah. us to walk in it. Oh, yes. We thank God for this season. Mm -hmm. Praise God. It's not um, coincidence that um, last uh, Friday, the retreat we had here, Holiness in Action. Mm -hmm. God wants to, us to resurrect now Amen. into action. Amen. Amen. No Amen. amount of talking will, will help us. Yes. We, God is the God of action. Yes. Yes. All right. Talking of practicality. Yeah. Because um, from my experience, I've seen that, um, in fact, if not all the time, most of the time we are very good at um, talking. Mm -hmm. Just like um, right. people um, or spectators at a football match, we will play, oh, this, they stand there. They know how to score yeah, outside. <laughs> but if they ask to go in there and play, they won't. May God help us to be Amen. doers of the word. Amen. Not hear us only, yeah. deceiving ourselves. Yeah. Do you really believe? Do I really believe? When we say, storms do not alarm me. Right. They sometimes must cease. They will. May God help us when those storms come. Amen. We remember this. Amen. Amen. And not um, get um, go back into our shell. And come out to work for God. If we lose sight of the resurrection, we will will become sluggish in our love and our service, and our sacrifices or consecration to God. And our lives will become pathetic. Let's um, read from First Corinthians chapter 15. First Corinthians 15, 32, verse 32b. It's
Paul, writing about the resurrection, had so many things to say. Mm. He mentioned here, mm. he said, after, if after the manner of men I have fought with beasts at Ephesus, what advantageth it me if the dead rise not? <laughs> Let us eat and drink, for tomorrow we die. Is that my attitude? Is that your attitude? Peter writing sometime in, to um, the, the people said, well, the time will come. So people will say, this, what about the promise of his coming? It's, since the fathers been slept, uh, it's just the same thing. So one could say, okay, well, life will still go on. Let us eat, drink, and marry. There's nothing. But there is something. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, yes. There's something coming. Yeah. We shall rise. Amen. On the resurrection morning. Amen. When the trump of God shall sound. Amen. We sing, he arose, he arose, hallelujah, mm -hmm. Christ arose. Mm -hmm. Remember, when he was walking with them, these two gentlemen, to Emmaus, was talking, and he was listening to them, and then they called him, Come and have meat with us. And then when Jesus opened the understanding, Amen. may God open our understanding. Amen. 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 They said, oh, they realized, oh, there was, we were feeling warmth in our heart. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. Mm -hmm. Did not our heart burn within us while he talked with us mm -hmm. by the way and while he opened to us the scriptures how many times do we listen to teachings sermons and you feel the fire we run to the altar we pray we, as, as if to shake this building but as soon as we get up from here, is the fire still burning? Are we still feeling the warmth of the Holy Spirit within us? May God help us. Amen. Amen. The hope of the resurrection should make a difference right. in our lives. All right. All right. That's what we take to God in prayer. We're not going to be the same again. Amen. 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 Because if after um, we have eaten and drunk at the table of the Lord mm -hmm. from time to time, and yet we still feel that all we have or we are here for mm -hmm. is for this life. Mm -hmm. Paul said that we are of all men miserable. If all we live here is for, oh, eat, drink, do this, build houses, have children, do... Uh, no, it's more than that. Yeah, that's true. It's more than that. First Corinthians um, 15, this uh, same chapter we read before. Well, let's read uh, from verse 3. For I deliver unto you, first of all, that which I also received. Mm -hmm. How that Christ died for our sins according to the scriptures. Mm -hmm. And that he was buried and that he rose again the third day according to the scriptures. Mm -hmm. And that he was seen of safe as then of the twelve. Mm -hmm. After that, he was seen of above 500 brethren at once, of whom the greater part remain unto this present, 
but some have fallen asleep. After that, he was seen of James, then of all the apostles. And last of all, he was seen of me also, right. as of one born out of due season. Mm -hmm. Paul was writing this to um, a dysfunctional church in Corinth. There, was a, oh, there were disagreements of leadership, sexual sin, marriage problems, idolatry, mm -hmm. and so on. Paul addressed all these issues, but at the very end, he said that they had to know one thing of first importance, that Jesus died and rose from the grave. Yes. He went on in great detail to describe that. Please, I enjoin you to read that the whole chapter and see what he's written there. We're not going to read all that. Jesus didn't just resurrect spiritually, as people talk about out there. Mm. Was the physical body oh, yeah. got up oh, too? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Amen. True. Thank God, um, we've seen the place. Yeah. I'm some of us who we went to Israel. We've seen the place. The he's no more there. Hallelujah! Hallelujah. Praise God. And he's not dead. Amen. He's alive. Amen. He's coming back again. Yeah. So when that trump shall sound, the dead in Christ will rise. Mm -hmm. So we have a hope. Yeah. Thank God. Thank that this body. So when the songwriter says, when this lisping, stamina tongue of mine lies silent in the grave. There is hope in that body there, lying down there. Sometimes you see people brought here. Well, the little we know about them, we may express that from time to time. But through it all, God, who knows all of us? Yes, he does. He knows where we are lying down there. People may be weeping here. There is hope. Amen. The hope of resurrection. Amen. For that um, saint of God. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's why um, we are not to sorrow as the world sorrow. Right. But now that we are still alive, mm -hmm. it behooves us to right. put things right. Right. Blessing. And um, live in that hope. Mm -hmm. So that our hope will not be in vain. Amen. False hope. Mm -hmm. No. May God uh, take that away from Amen. us. Amen. Amen. Give us this lively hope. Amen. Amen. Because uh, we're expecting to get into an inheritance mm -hmm. that God has prepared for us. Mm -hmm. We need to think again, you know that when Jesus rose from the dead, that has um, eternal significance for us, that we will live forever with him. Yeah. And not yeah. just forever with him, but we'll live with glorified bodies, yeah. just like his, mm -hmm. with power yeah. and glory. Amen. And that, and that life that is far better than what we know now. Wouldn't you like to have such a life? Yeah. We're looking forward to that time. Yeah. Yes. And the trump can sound any time. Right. So we need to be ready. As we go from day to day, living in that hope, that hope will direct our path. Amen. Amen. Like we studied 
So what would Jesus do? The actions that needed to be carried out. May God give us the enabling Amen. to live daily, not only for ourselves. We live for him yeah. who died. said, whether therefore ye eat or drink, whatsoever ye do, you do all to the glory of God. Amen. As we celebrate this day, this day of hope. Yeah. Amen. Praise God. May Amen. God um, help us to apply our hearts Amen. unto wisdom. Amen. As we come to pray, may the Holy Spirit descend. Amen.